how is it going everybody mr android here welcome back to a brand new video on this channel well one of the main reasons why most of us prefer android is because of the customization it offers and that's what today's video is all about Today we will be taking a look at some of the best applications that will help level up your android customization and take it to the next level. Guys I am sure you will end up installing a couple of amazing apps on your phone from this video so make sure you watch it until the very end. Also let's aim for at least 1000 likes on this one. With that said drop a like leave a comment and let's get started. Let's start off with a really unique launcher that I recently found out and it's called shelf launcher. This is a free open source launcher that is designed to make your home screen look clean and organized so you can focus more on productivity. Once you set it as your default launcher, you get this card style layout that shows all your applications along with a search bar where you can quickly search anything from an app or a contact and it even allows you to search directly in Google Chrome. Now one of the most useful feature you get right on your home screen is this quick note widget at the top where you can quickly take down all your notes with just a single tap. Apart from this, the launcher has some useful shortcuts like when you double tap at the bottom, it opens your favorite application and long pressing an icon will directly take you to the app info screen. There is also this dock available at the bottom of your screen that shows the exact time and some more shortcuts to quickly access anything you want. All in all, I think it's a clean, minimalistic launcher that has many interesting features. Be sure to check this one out. You will find all the links in the description below. Next up, we have a brand new wallpaper app from one of my all-time favorite tech creators, MKBHD and it's called Panels. Now like most of the wallpaper apps on the Play Store, this app brings wallpapers from different creators across the globe and curates them into collections. When you open the app for the first time, it will ask you to select at least 5 different creators you like the most and the app will show you the wallpapers based on your selection. One thing that I really liked about this app is that the UI looks modern and well designed with some nice animations and there is a separate section where you can download wallpapers that you see on Marcus videos. You can see there are hundreds of high quality full resolution wallpapers that will fully transform your phone into visual masterpiece. Not only does it have a stunning collection of wallpapers, but you also get customizations like you can actually change how the app icon looks in your app drawer and there are quite a few options to choose from. Now the only drawback is that you need to watch a couple of ads in order to download wallpapers for completely free and if you want to save them in 4K resolution then you need to have the subscription which is quite annoying. So if you're looking for a high quality wallpaper app with an exclusive collection then definitely give this app a try. If you want to try the latest iOS 18 control center on your Android smartphone, you need to install an app called Control Center 18 which is available for free on the Play Store. Once installed, simply open it and allow the required permissions. In the app, you can change the trigger position from where you want to access the control center, change the background wallpaper and there are a bunch of options you get within the app itself. Once you are done setting up the application, now when you swipe from your desired position, you will get this redesigned iOS control center that works just like iOS 18. When you swipe up, you get the connectivity page along with a separate music control layout and the best part is you can also change the size and reposition the toggles as per your need. So if you want to experience the iOS 18 control center on your Android device, you should definitely check this one out. At number 4, we have another open source application that goes by the name called Paperize. What it basically does is, it allows you to apply different set of wallpapers both on your home screen as well as the lock screen and then the app will change the wallpaper automatically depending on the time intervals that you have selected. All you have to do is simply open the app and choose a bunch of wallpapers that you like to create a library of your own. Once done, you can then adjust the time interval when the wallpaper should change and even you can control the brightness for a specific wallpaper. Now your phone's wallpaper will change automatically according to your settings. If you are someone who keeps changing the wallpapers and love customization, then it's a must have application for you. Next up, we have an app called Taskbar. This app activates a really useful dock right at the bottom of your screen so you can quickly access your most used applications from anywhere while using your smartphone. This taskbar constantly changes the app list depending on the apps you are frequently using. This way, you can easily switch between them one after the other without having to close the current app, go back to your home screen and search for the other applications. 
The app also offers a lot of customizations like changing the background color, adjusting the transparency of the taskbar, applying different icon packs, adding more applications to the dock, and there is an option to quickly open the app drawer in a pop-up view. I think it's a really useful app that not only saves a lot of your time, but also improves the multitasking experience on your smartphone. Finally, we have an app called Edge Control. It's an ideal customization tool for Android that lets you control two of the most commonly adjusted settings which are the volume and display brightness by just swiping on either the left or right edge of your screen. You just need to install the app, I love the permissions. Then there are a few tweaks you can make within the app settings. For example, you can decide which side controls which settings and there is an option to increase the width as well. Once done, now whenever you want to adjust your phone's volume or display brightness, Instead of opening the quick settings panel, you can simply swipe over the edges like this. It works quite well and the best part is it works within any application you are using on your smartphone. Definitely try this one out, you will find all the links in the description below. So that's pretty much it for this video. These are some amazing customization apps you need to download on your smartphone. If you guys like this video then be sure to hit that like button, subscribe to this channel if you haven't already. I am Mr. Android and I will see you guys in the next one.